Do you feel the need to moisturize? Today, we are going to talk about body lotion. My name is Leia and you're watching Leia Whisper. I can't forget the day we met Your eyes so blue, me pressing through I can't forget the day we met Your smile so bright, it made me small I love is like a summer Let's talk about the elephant in the room moisturizing now a lot of people talk about how supple their skin is and mine when i was younger yes but as you get older then your skin needs to moisturize a lot because you develop a lot of like skin irregularities so let us put the lotion in the basket Put the lotion in the basket. <laughs> Today we are going to talk about what I use for moisturizing. I always use a body butter. Since I was like in college, I've been using Body Shop. The Body Shop is very animal friendly. So what I normally use after showering, I use the Body Shop body butter. And you know when you need to take a shower, you're still like wet. Oh, and this is so divine. I love it so much. I put a good amount of body butter. So like I just got out of the shower, I I put the towel a little bit and then I lather even if my skin is a little bit wet so it sort of glide on your body and then it moisturizes your skin that's what i love about body butters this one is called kukoi cream it's blissful ritual hawaiian women exposed to the relentless sun for generations hmm have held the secret of kukui oil to nurture their skin, bursting with luscious moisture. Kukui oil restores skin's natural suppleness, leaving it nourished and glowing, smooth on from decolletage to toes until fully absorbed. And it smells so divine. Now, I also use, because I have a skin problem, Ever since I arrived here in US like 11 years ago, I had some blemish in my skin. I used to have like really nice skin, but when I got here, it also comes with age that whenever like your skin is not as supple or youthful as it was before. So now I also develop like rushes, also probably with like the food that I eat um, I have a lot here on my arms and I feel like it's also because I may have celiac but then again I would never know because I do not go to the doctor <laughs> what else as I was watching TikTok one of the doctors of TikTok said I should use we should use amlactin and this is the alpha hydroxy therapy this one is a moisturizing body lotion fragrance free moisturizer contains powerful 12 percent lactic acid that is clinically proven to boost the skin's natural renewal process through gentle exfoliation reveal softer smoother skin with daily use says here direction is to shake well um, apply two times daily as directed by a physician boosts healthy skin renewal through gentle exfoliation deeply moisturized well let me tell you about this this lotion is I didn't really like the smell it's like yes I use some of this lotion on my hands 
they say it's really good. Mm. Okay. It smells like glue. Not a big fan of this, but I use it when I'm not going anywhere. Basically, if I'm at home, I'm not doing anything, I'm not going anywhere, no one will be able to like smell me. And it is what it is. When I was in college, I remember when I was like younger, my college best friend, she and I loved the body shop. Every time we have like, like the lip gloss. But what I really use from body shop is this. This is called the Almond Nail and Cuticle Manicure Oil. Now this, I really recommend this to everyone. Sometimes you don't have manicure and then you just like put it in your cuticle and voila it looks like you take care of your nails but you really don't this one really i've been using it for the longest time and i have really hard nail beds ever since i was like maybe high school or in college i use the victoria's secret lotion why because i love the smell the victoria's secret collection when I was younger, I loved strawberries and champagne, pear glaze, and love spell. But I'm always drawn by the smell of pear glaze. So the pear glaze, as you know, Victoria's Secret has new packaging when they rebranded. And this is how it looks now in their lotion. I usually wear perfume and I go to work, but nowadays there's nowhere to go. So I basically use the Victoria's Secret Pear Glaze. Oh, the smell. The smell. So nice. So after I put body butter, that's when I apply the lotion. Put the lotion on your skin and put the lotion in your basket yes i am in love with the pear glaze still this with the m lactin still smells disgusting but the pear glaze oh my god so nice smell i've always told this to everyone that i know the victoria's secret or any body lotion if it has a matching body mist use it it sort of like combined it gives you that lasting smell and you know like when you're in college or when you're younger you go to school and you want it to always smell really nice so even just a tiny bit of that smell people remember you like i know that a lot of people during that time say that oh my god you smell so good i wonder why nobody tells me that anymore but at first you're going to think you don't want that intensity of smell when you walk in a room but then if you're using the victoria's secret body lotion and body mist it's not really that intense like there's a tinge of smell and then it's like you smell good you know what i mean so i always recommend to people to match your body mist and your body lotion for a lasting smell if you apply your body lotion and your body mist it's really not intense it's more of like complementary so it complements the smell and then it's super lasting do you apply your moisturizer right after you take a shower because that's what i do and that's what you need to do as well like as soon as you take a shower as i've said what i do i apply the body butter and the body butter it glides through my skin and then it absorbs that's the time when i'm completely dry i apply my body lotion 
And then after I put my bottle lotion, I of course use the body mist. Let's try the hair glaze. First, let me tell you that I'm also in love with peach. So anything peach, I love it. I am going to apply this. In this area, that's what I use, the amlactin. And here, I'm going to lather it with the peach grease. Oh no, I'm going to smell so weird. So the peach squeeze is more of like tinge of the peachy smell. Oh, so good. Now let's try to complement that smell. That's so good. I use the peach squeeze body mist and Because I, I don't spray it like really close to me. What I do is I spray it farther and then I step. Oh, so good. I really love that smell. The smell of the Victoria's Secret Paraglaze is the best. So if you're looking for original Victoria's Secret, if you're in Naga City or in Beagle region, contact House of Sun. This is so good. Peach squeeze. Oh, so good. I love peach. The smell. Oh. I can still smell the amlactin. Let me try the berry glaze on my arm. Okay, so now I'm like more this board of body lotion smell. So over here, I used um, pear glaze and over here in this area, I used the peach squeeze. I can still smell it. And then here I used amlactin. And of course, on my legs, I used uh, the Body Shop Hawaiian Cream. And those are the things that I use for now. Put the lotion in the basket. Buffalo Bill. And there you have it. Join us again next time for another episode of Lay a Whisper. Lay a Whisper. On my pillow. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and hit the notification bell. Today I am wearing the plush bathrobe from Victoria's Secret and nothing else. It is really super plush. And this plush robe has a matching slippers. <laughs> Ta-da! I love it.